it has existed since man could understand the concept of pain. It has existed since man could suffer. Many ancient cultures have very diverse myths about the creation of the world, life, and human purpose. The concept of disease, however, always seemed to be pinned on malevolent spirits or demons. The Nosoi, the Ghoul, and the Membabaraka are a few examples. As time carried on, these were diminished as silly tales from primitive cultures. However, that only allowed for it to move more freely. If people aren't looking for it, how could it be inhibited? Usually, with spirits or gods, they wither and die if they are forgotten. This creature is quite the opposite. It fares better if no one is looking. It delights in our attempts to control its handiwork. The creature has changed vastly over the course of its existence. The form of if it chooses changes on it on a whim. Depending on how it feels like terrorizing the population. Sometimes it appears as a human skeleton, sometimes the bones. Sometimes it wears a mask, like a plague doctor's of old. It has been known to take the form of animals. However, the appearance of it chooses doesn't matter. The only ones who have ever seen it are usually artists that are mentally unstable. If no one believes them, it will only show itself to those who it deems worthy. Pray you are never deemed worthy. It is not only the origin of disease, but it's also its guardian. It creates pandemic fun, letting them loose upon the world, laughing at the hysteria and panic it creates. It ensures that disease is never stopped. It helps them mutate, resist vaccines, and grow stronger. Do you know how many diseases it actually have actually been cured. 1. Smallpox This nasty creature is behind most of history's great pandemics. The, but the Bhutanic Plague? It was. Yellow Fever? It was. AIDS? That one was actually the US government, but you can bet the creature wiped the terror of joy from its eye and smile. Proud of how humanity has learned from its techniques. So while modern medicine does everything it can to keep the creature at bay, while not even acknowledging it, it smiles and continues to turn the natural wheel of mor morality. The more disease we try to fix, the more it will rain upon us. It is the only one way to be born. Get over a thousand to die, and now you know the reason.